Hosing down the charred remains of the back of 8 Marie Street in Dorchester seemed like it would be one of the last challenges of the day for Boston firefighters, but it sure wasn't. Like, I thought it was rain, and then I heard something like dragon, and then we looked out the window and saw, saw the flames. I was sleeping, and I heard crackling noises. It sounded like rain, and then the fire just... We all ran out. Residents rushed from their homes at 4 o'clock in the morning as flames engulfed a vacant triple-decker under renovation. Firefighters fought back flames and called for a sixth alarm because of how close the homes are to each other. There was five buildings damaged, three extensively. The two buildings in the rear more suffered uh, the siding and everything burnt and some scorching to the outside of the structure. And then, just before 8 o'clock, with the fire seemingly out, power crews had to make way for the return of firefighters first with intense smoke rising from number six, and a few minutes after that, intense flames shooting through the roof at number 10. One firefighter hurt his ankle. We saw EMTs treating him before he was transported. He is expected to be okay. And though no residents were hurt, 16 of them can't stay in their homes. Terrible, people are displaced. You know, people lost everything they worked hard for. These fire crews on Marie Street finally packing up and leaving more than six hours after the first flames. In Dorchester, Josh Brogadier, WCVB News Center 5.